In the midst of the swirling dust and pulsating energy of the bullring, Juan Belmonte, the famed bullfighter, stood poised, his heart pounding with a mixture of fear and exhilaration. The crowd roared around him, their cries blending with the thunderous hooves of the charging bull. As the beast charged, Juan's mind danced with thoughts and emotions, much like the intricate steps of a well-choreographed ballet. Ah, the beauty of this dance, Juan mused silently, his eyes locked onto the fierce gaze of the charging bull. Each step, each movement, a symphony of grace and strength. He felt the surge of adrenaline coursing through his veins, heightening his senses, sharpening his focus. In this moment, he was not just a bullfighter, but an artist, a master of the dance with death. The bull's horns glinting in the sunlight became extensions of Juan's own body, an elegant extension of his will. As he gracefully sidestepped the bull's charge, a surge of pride welled up within him. The intricate footwork, the precise timing, it all came together in a seamless display of skill and bravery. He was the matador, the hero of the arena, and the crowd's adoration fueled his every move. But amidst the excitement, Juan couldn't help but appreciate the grand spectacle unfolding before him. The bull, in its raw power and untamed spirit, was a force of nature. Its every muscle rippled with intensity, and its eyes burned with a primal fire. It was a creature designed for battle, and Juan recognized its noble spirit. It is not just I who dance here, Juan reflected a touch of humility coloring his thoughts. The bull too dances with me, a partner in this magnificent ballet of life and death. With each pass of the cape, each deft movement, Juan wove his own story within the larger narrative of the bullfight. The ebb and flow of the encounter were like the rise and fall of a great symphony, building towards a crescendo of climax and release. The crowd's cheers and gasps, like the applause of a rapt audience, spurred Juan to push further, to test the limits of his own courage and skill. He felt an indescribable connection to the spectators, their energy fueling his every step, their admiration becoming his lifeblood. And as the final act drew near, Juan couldn't help but marvel at the beauty of this dance with death. The bull, now wearied but never defeated, embodied the essence of life's struggle. Their battle was not one of malice or cruelty, but of two souls entwined in a primal display of courage and determination. As the final pass came to an end, Juan Belmonte stood, panting and bloodied, his heart a mix of triumph and gratitude. The bull, its spirit spent, gazed at him with weary eyes. In that moment, Juan felt a profound respect for the creature that had given him such a powerful and transformative experience. It is not just a dance with death, Juan whispered, his voice carried away by the wind. It is a dance with life itself. And with those words he bid farewell to the arena, knowing that this dance would forever remain etched in his soul, a testament to the indomitable spirit of both man and beast.